The First World War began on July 28, 1914, when Austria-Hungary declared war on Serbia. This small conflict between two countries spread rapidly, eventually involving the majority of Europe, the Ottoman Empire, and the United States. Due to the United States' involvement in the war, Michael Nikolic was assigned to be Dr. Fox's Serbian aide in Semendria, Serbia. Dr. Fox was deployed to Semendria to assist the Italian Red Cross combat, a typhus epidemic in Serbia. Due to his involvement, he died from septic pneumonia. As a result, Michael Nikolic wrote a letter to Mrs. Fox offering his condolences. In the beginning of his letter, he states, I have received your letter, to which I am answering now, informing the reader that he and Mrs. Fox have exchanged letters in the past and developed a relationship. He soon develops pathos by offering her his condolences of her husband's death, empathizing that he too has lost a loved one. Throughout the letter, Michael Nikolic establishes ethos by explaining to Mrs. Fox how he cared for Dr. Fox when he became ill, noting that he was always by Dr. Fox's side until his final days. In this letter, Michael Nikolic gives historical information on the activities he and Dr. Fox partook in. He states, Mr. Fox went to Semendria on the 2nd of February, and the letter that you had was written in Semendria, but sent from Belgrade. Here, he notes that he and Dr. Fox moved profusely within Serbia. Dr. Fox and Michael Nikolic were often in and out of Belgrade due to the constant battles between Belgrade and Austro-Hungarian forces. Due to Michael Nikolic and Dr. Fox traveling often, Dr. Fox's health began to deteriorate, eventually resulting in his death. Dr. Fox and Michael Nikolic developed a genuine relationship during the war. Michael Nikolic dedicated his life to serving the Allied powers, while Dr. Fox dedicated his life to saving and treating the victims of the epidemic. He died an honorable death.